All right, we are back, and we have a special guest, Heritage High School Class of 2000, running back, player of the year, Emory and Henry, football player now, Mr. K.J. Vaughn. K.J., what's going on, brother? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Doing good, man. Going good. How you going in your first year up there? It's great. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Sophomore year. You know what I'm saying? Rocking out. Everybody, you know what I'm saying, coming back and stuff. So everything's straight. The grades, I know on 1,000. I know the grades. Yeah. Right? You already know that. Got to keep. Right? That's good. Yeah. That's good. So how? So was you, what position they got you playing now? Uh, running back still. You right. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Still got to you feel me. Got to get right. I feel you, Zeke. <laughs> I feel you. All right, KJ. Now, you are a star of the Jug Bowl series, bro. Like yes, sir. Like, you've been in the Jug Bowl for uh, four years. So, talk to us a little bit about, you know, your experiences in the Jug Bowl. You know, I know you didn't beat you. I think you 3-1 and one against Glass. I think you only lost one time. So, talk a little bit about, you know, what the Jug Bowl and that experience meant to you and how it made you feel. Um, well, the Jug Bowl, my sophomore year, the first one, we lost. It was kind of crazy. I told my mom, like, after this one, we ain't losing no more. <laughs> so so then, so then, you know what I'm saying, junior year, it was that was a great game. Back and forth, action. You already know how that went. Yep. Senior year, that was that was the biggest one because it's my senior year. Drake Ken senior year, everybody else senior year. And we all grew up together. So that was another one. That was another feeling that we all grew up together and played football together. And going against each other in the high school level, in that type of atmosphere, all you seen coming to City Stadium is orange on one side, straight royal blue on the other side. So it was crazy. No um, and then that was just winning, winning those, you know what I'm saying, those, those last two was, was crazy to me because yeah. I had something to do with it. So no, hey, it was hey, it was a great game, man. And it's like with me, it's bittersweet because, like I said, you know, I got I, I I'm without anybody. I'm glass to the bone, you know. But you know, y'all, oh, you know, dogs, you know how I love y'all, how I feel about y'all. So yeah. the only game that I didn't want you to win was the glass game. But you know what? <laughs> I I always go home. I, I be mad, but then I be like, well, shoot. My dog KJ got down. My dog Christian got down. My dog yeah. Lonnie got down. You know, and, and, and so on and so forth. So it was like, dang, we lost to him. But at the end of the day, I was happy for y'all. And yeah. we ain't never talked about this, KJ, really. But that senior year, you know what? I couldn't really see it, see it. So I ain't going to really talk about it. But what you tell me about that last play. Coach Bradley, you know, he he he, put, he made a gutsy call, man, and he called your number and just walk us through that play. For y'all that don't know what happened during that play, you know, it was um, overtime, Glass had scored, uh, Harris came back and scored, and then they went for two. So I'm going to let KJ take it from there. All right, so from when they called, when we called a timeout, we called a timeout, we got in the huddle. Coach Bradley said, so how should we win it? Kyron. BB to Coach Martin, all of them said, "Get a ball to KJ." The horse. And and in my head, in my head, you're I'm already, you know, what I'm saying I'm already. I had a good game so far, so you know, what I'm saying I had to go ahead and finish it out. Okay. And with with the team, with my offensive line that I had, it was a great offensive line. You know what I'm saying? Shante, Mike, oh, Gavin, you yeah. know, what I'm saying Spencer has Christian in the backfield with me. But um, going through the play, when I hiked the ball, I kind of you kind of see me go out and then stick my foot in the ground, go back inside. And when I went back inside, I kind of knew, all right, now it's time. I'm in I'm in the trenches with it, so I got to drive. Yeah. So when I started driving, holding, uh, I I forget who told me it was. Well, he grabbed my shoulder, and when he grabbed me, I turned. And when I turned, I end up laying on number twelve. You know, when I laid on number twelve. I'm still not down technically, so I cross over, leaning backwards. So then, and then everything just started clearing out. I seen my cousin X, he put his hands on his head, and I'm like, I'm like, oh, so then I get in, and everybody else saying I was out, and you know what I'm saying? So then the white hat came in, threw his hands up, touchdown heritage. So then that was the game. So when I, after the game, you know what I'm saying, my granddad, I was thinking about him the whole week, you know what I'm saying? 
and I took a knee at the 50 yard line. My coach, Coach Jackson, grabbed me and said, You know who was on your back? I was like, Yeah, you know what I'm saying? He was like, Your grandfather was on your back. Yeah. So, so that was a little cool experience right there. So, yeah, having to do something with that win, it's kind of crazy. I know I made a lot of people mad. I know I made a lot of people happy. But, but you know what, man? Day, it's, it's, it's like this. You may, if people was upset, people was happy, but at the end of the day, for us real football fans and, and supporters of all the kids, a, we loved it, it because it was, it was a, a great game. Match. We couldn't ask for nothing. We, our money couldn't have bought us no, but not a better game, man. That was yeah. a great game. And the fact that, like I said, that you was a big part of that, and you know, that, yo, you inked forever in history, bro. Like, they always gonna look back, oh, let's look 2002, I mean, 2019, 2019 game. KJ Vaughn, no time on the clock. Gutsy call by Bradley. Legs keep churning. Touchdown. You know, you, you, and those those are the type of things that that that, that makes these rivalries prestigious and it makes them forgettable. Yeah. Because twenty years you can be telling your son about this. Yeah, when yeah. I was in high school, I crossed town rival. Boom! I scored the winning extra point to win the game. You know, and, yeah. that, and that's, that's a beautiful thing, man. I actually have those type of memories to share, man. And forever you're going to be a part of that jug bowl um, talk. You know, people going to be yeah. talking about you, you know, just like they talked about the previous. But um, we're glad to hear you're doing good, KJ, man. We yes, love sir. you, man. And, yes. and before we go, we just want to get your prediction for this week's game. Because I know you're going to be there. I know you're going to be there. Yeah, I'm going to try to be there, yeah. So, got to, you know what I'm saying? I feel like, I'm a gotta, I am got to go with my dogs. No question. I go with As, my you dog. As you should. As you should. I go with my dogs. I say, I say, me personally, I say since i seen Glass for the couple last couple of weeks, they've been having great football games. You know what I'm saying? They got a lot of talent on that side, especially in the backfield with Lil Marty. And you know what I'm saying? So I say, I say it's going to be a close game, but H-Town got to come over top. Each time. I say by three. They close. They always gonna be close, but I need a score. I need a score. I say. I say. I say. Mm, Twenty seventeen. Twenty seventeen. Twenty seventeen. HHS. You heard it from the dog. My dog. K Train. KJ Vaughn. Class of twenty twenty. Heard his graduate. Currently on the Emory and Henry football team as a running back. Support him, man. He's a great kid. Always been a great kid. No trouble. Good grades. Great athlete. Just an overall great person. So, KJ. Yes, sir. We're going to revisit this conversation next week, man. All right? Yes, sir. All right, get yes, back sir, to bro. class, man. I took up enough of your time. Have a good one, bro. All right, bro. All right. All right. Love y'all, man. Love you, too. Thank you, guys, for watching Drake and Talk. Be on the lookout for more exclusive content. Like, share, subscribe, Drake and Talk, out.